everyone. Welcome to my kitchen. Tita Ruth's kitchen. Tonight I'm going to prepare a homemade fresh chocolate cups with fresh fruits and the cream on top. Okay, all you need to do is to boil water. I'm going to show you how it, it goes. I prepare a water here, which is, I'm boiling, yeah, it will boil later because I'm going to show you the ingredients of the dessert that I'm making. Which is not live TV. Okay, everybody, my ingredients are my fresh fruits, my chocolate, and my my ice water this one the ice cubes hope you know how to make it my husband said <laughs> okay since now i'm boiling water this is maybe one cup of water one liter of water to boil and then when it's heated like that i'm going i'm just going to put my my chocolate in there that chocolate in there to melt okay okay so I'm going to put the chocolate inside the purpose of that is to melt that chocolate There, the chocolate is is trying to melt slowly. There you see. Okay. Okay, the chocolate is slowly melting into into melt chocolate. And FYI, guys, you need to use a good chocolate so that you can feel the the finest of your your dessert okay everyone the chocolate is now melting still melting he is taking its time to melt the chocolate okay friends the chocolate is seems like already melted yeah Okay, I never feel anything in there already. It's all melted already. You have to make sure that the chocolate has no water mixed into it. It's a pure chocolate. Okay, so I stir it. I never see any lumps of the chocolate now. It's, we feel that it's ready. Okay, we're going to remove the chocolate from there. And I place it here. Okay. Okay, now we're going to do the, the fun part of this project. This eyes of mine, I'm going to just take this out. Crack it out from the water, from the package. Okay, and just dip it like that in here, all the way. Okay, here, there, the chocolate is forming or is getting cold in there. The second one, there. Okay, this is a parching paper so that the chocolate won't stick. You have to quickly do it because the chocolate is getting colder and it's not nice to maneuver. 
there. Okay. So the parching paper is the one that do the the magic here. Okay. So the chocolate is already very dry because of the ice. See, look at that. It can just easily remove the ice from the chocolate. There you go. Here. That is the way how it is okay yeah some is not really formed but as long as you dip it really well into the melted chocolate it once it's dry is the ice is very very easy to remove and the form is it would it should be perfect okay so i'm going to put something into the chocolate this time the fruits that i have here okay and now i'm going to put something into my chocolate like that what do you want onto your chocolate love okay here Or this one here. So, friends, these are the outcome of the chocolate cups that I have made through that ice and you can also put some cream on top of it like that like that it's so rich yeah so that's my chocolate cup with fruits and the cream toppings well, about the cream, it's up to you if you want to put cream or if you do not want to put cream, it's okay. But it depends to everybody's preference. So that is my dessert for tonight. Okay, and see you on my next video.